Hello everyone. My name is Abhishek and welcome back to my channel. A lot of people are asking how much time will it take to get a job in DevOps? I have explained multiple times before that this is not the right question. The right question is how much time will I take to become job ready in DevOps or to learn DevOps? In this video, we will talk more about this particular topic. Stay tuned and watch it till the end. First of all, why is it not a right question to ask? How much time will it take to get a job? Because there are multiple factors. For example, you might be job ready in DevOps. You might have learned DevOps. But at the time you started applying for the jobs, the market might be down. You might be getting less number of interview calls or you might be in a region, maybe in US or some part of Europe where the DevOps opportunities are less. You might not be getting remote job opportunities or the possible reasons like your resume is not good. Your LinkedIn profile is not good. Your Naukri profile is not good or the job portal through which you are applying. Because of all of these factors, it is not possible to answer how much time will you take to get a job? But what we can answer is how much time will it take to learn DevOps? So to learn DevOps, what I have noticed in the last one year, two years back, if you would have asked me this question, I would have told you it will take 60 days to learn DevOps. But now the level of interviews has gone high to become job ready you would need to spend at least three to four months considering you are already in the IT background. That is, you are moving from QE to DevOps or you are moving from development, project management, any particular stream of IT to DevOps. Because if you are already in IT, you have some knowledge of the environments in IT, you have some knowledge of software development lifecycle. So it will take less time for you. That is three to four months. So you might be wondering, Abhishek, but what roadmap do I need to follow? Like right from zero, how to become job ready in DevOps? We have a roadmap. I have explained that in previous video. I will put that link in the description as well. It's called date roadmap. You can watch that using the link and you will understand the complete roadmap. I will not go into that roadmap in this video. Now, Abhishek, what about people with career gap, what about people who are coming from other industries like non IT background. So for you people, it will take little more time, maybe one month more because you need to get used to a lot of terms in IT. There are subscribers on the channel who have transitioned from non IT. There are subscribers from channel who have moved into DevOps with career gap as well. We have done podcasts with them also. So what I understood is it will take one to two months more. So maybe you can say four to six months to become job ready in DevOps because first you need to get used to some terms in the IT. You need to complete the roadmap. You need to do more practical hands on. Some people also prefer certifications. So for all of these things, you will take four to six months. Now, what about freshers? There are a lot of freshers on the channel who are targeting DevOps and cloud jobs. One good news for you is the complexity of the interview will be less because as a fresher, people will not expect that much from you from what they expect from the experienced candidates. But as a fresher, you will have equal number of unknowns. In your college, you will be trained in programming, C, C++, Java, or any other programming knowledge, but you will have less exposure towards DevOps and cloud. So again, considering all of these things, you will need three to four months as a fresher. Better you start in your final year of your college or you start sometime before, not at the peak of the final stage. Many people start at the final stage just before they start getting the placements. Instead, start three to four months early, at least, so that you will be job ready by the time of your 
placements if you are interested in devops and cloud of course one thing that i want to add is it also depends on the personal learning ability some people grasp things fast so for them it might take less time than what i mentioned however i wanted to give an overview of how much time will it take to learn devops i hope you found this video informative if you have any questions on this topic let me know in the comment section i will definitely answer your question thank you so much for watching today's video see you all in the next one take care bye bye